let's recap. Stormy Daniels fiasco, her testimony alone killed it. Oh, I hate him. Oh, I hate him. Oh, I want him to, you know. Da, da. Oh, and the jury's sitting there going, what are you doing here, lady? Why are you here? I said to Hannity today, look, the first question, and I don't believe Trump's lawyers are doing a great job. I mean, Murchan, the judge, said, we don't want any salacious testimony. And then 10 seconds later, there's salacious testimony. And then Murchan says, well, the reason was the Trump lawyers didn't object. He has a point. If I'm one of the Trump lawyers, I would have been objecting to every sentence the woman said. Now, I know why the Trump lawyers did it, because they want to show Murchan has no control over the courtroom, which he doesn't. Okay, so they can use that as an appeal. But it could have been better done. So anyway, um, if, you're, if you're sitting in the New York courtroom and you're a human being, you go, why is Stormy Daniels there? So she had a social interaction with Donald Trump. She says this happened. Trump says it didn't. But there was a social interaction. They have a picture. Okay. So that happened in 2006. And in 2016, you're demanding money. For what? Why are you demanding money from the National Enquirer or anybody else? Why? For what? That's the first question. What are you doing here, lady? You know why she's there. We went over to the doorman yesterday. His story is completely bogus, and he got $30,000. And any human being on earth would have said, look, the presidential election is in seven days. You know, we got to shut these people up. Anybody would have done that because the press is going to look into the allegations. Let's put it on page one. Thank you for watching. To view full episodes of the No Spin News anytime, sign up to become a BillOReilly.com premium or concierge member today.